Okay, let's be very careful. And there it is! Oh, man, we got past that part finally. Oh, Bowser, no! No, Bowser! No, no! everybody, Choo Choo here and you're watching me play Super Mario Maker! I'm gonna attempt Stampy's map first. And then, we're gonna make a map for him! See how he gets on. <laughs> if you guys have seen some of our previous episodes, we've both been making each other maps and it's been really difficult to try get on his level because he's been making some really hard levels. So what I'm gonna try do is make him a very sneaky level indeed i'm gonna make him a level that he is going to have to go back to the future in order to complete so that's what i'm gonna do for him but before we do that let's get straight into and kick stampies <laughs> and <laughs> let's do it let's do his level let's go in and complete bowser boozled okay i wonder what this is gonna be like Okay, so we're using uh, the latest Mario, I think it's Super Mario, so this is really sweet, and so far not so hard, I think I might be able to jump up here, let me see, I think you can jump off walls in this one, so that's pretty good, and then we've got just lots of parkour, which I'm doing pretty good, if you don't mind me saying myself, so let's see, we're going over here, and uh, maybe I can use this thing here, to jump here and then get across. Oh, that was pretty good. But how am I going to get past? How am I going to get past this? No way. How am I meant to get past? This is really tough. How am I meant to get past my main man Bowser here? This is going to be very difficult indeed. Okay, so let's. Uh, oh, I got wrecked. I was going to say let's try going back and figuring that out. Now, guys, <clears throat> I'm not going to lie. This looks really hard. I'm going to have to try figure out a way to get past this. And I bet Stampy's watching this laughing at me right now. Because I was not expecting it to be this difficult. So let's uh, let's um, try get maybe one of these guys to try help me. And what I could do is I could get one of these guys and put it through that gap Bowser was in. And maybe they'll be able to either take out Bowser or break the hole. So let me try to do this real fast. So I'm going to have to jump really fast. And boom! Oh, that hit him once. Maybe I need to do what all three of those dudes. Okay, this is definitely a lot more difficult than I thought. So let's try go back and get another one of those shells and slowly but surely take out Bowser in this Bowser Boozled. I love the map. It's so awesome. Okay, so let's... um. Sneak up here. Oh, no, I didn't even see that little spike. Oh, very difficult. Okay, so let's go get it straight away. I'm going to go real fast, jump across here like a hot potato. Hop down here. And, oh, no, stop killing my shells. I need those shells, man. These are my shells. Get out of here. Okay, let's go. Let's jump across here. Jump, jump, jump. Hot potato, hot potato. Oh, I tried to skip the platform by doing a big giant jump and that was an epic fail. Okay, so what I really love about Mario is the fact that you kind of, you know, you kind of don't expect to complete it first try. Well, at least I don't anyway, so <laughs> there's no pressure messing up. Whereas if this was some other game, I'd be like, okay, if I get killed, I'm probably... You know, never gonna upload this or whatever, but when I'm playing Mario, I don't expect to do too good anywho, so let's try get across here. And what just happened? Oh, the guy woke up out of his shell and kicked me in the butt. Okay, we're not gonna let that happen again. Lesson learned. I completely forgot about that as well. So let's jump over here as fast as we can, like a gingerbread man or the Mario. And <laughs> let's go get this shell here. Excuse me, Mr. Shell. I need your shell because I'm gonna go get Bowser with your head. Okay, let's jump across here. Oh, 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 there we go. And oh, no, Bowser got me as well. What a meanie weenie jelly beanie. That is so tough. Okay, hopefully we're doing this the correct way. What if I meant to go somewhere else? Hmm. Let's see. Let's see what we're meant to do. If Mario can do the go-go, oh no. It's Mario and he just got taken out like a big bell sprout. Wait, this isn't Pokemon. This is Memory Mario. Let's see. Come on, Mario. You can do it. <laughs> okay. I'm going to do it this time. I believe. I believe in a thing called Mario. <laughs> Okay, I've got my little, I've got my little wiener here. Come on, wiener, let's go. I'm gonna call those guys wieners from now on. Okay, guys, they are called little wieners. Oh no! 
Oh, and I dropped my wiener. I mean, I dropped my... Yeah, I dropped my wiener. <laughs> Little wieners. All right, let's go. Let's try to get that. I think a wiener is like a hot dog in America. If anybody can tell me what you guys call hot dogs over there, or are they like corn dogs? What is a corn dog? We don't have said corn dogs in Ireland. I just got wrecked again. I wonder what a corn dog is. I'm really getting off topic here, but this is hilarious. Okay, let's keep going and get the little dude we need to get. Come on, my love. Let's go, mate. Come on, mate. Let's go, mate. Let's go, mate. <laughs> let's run here as fast as we can. <gasps> there we go. Get out of there, Bowser, you big pooper scooper. You can't get me. Oh. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> okay, Bowser, you and your big your big fireballs are just showing off now. Look, ooh, I can do big giant fireballs. <laughs> Come on, Mario, let's go, honey. Oh, working nine till five. Do you want a way to make a Mario level? Okay, let's go, Bowser. Bowser goes to the boozle. Okay, here we go, here we go. Please have my little wieners here. Hello, wiener. Excuse me, sir. I need to go collect my wiener. Hello, wiener. How are we doing today, my little wiener schnitzel? Let's go. We've got wiener here. And uh, let's bring wiener over here. Uh, let's go. Heep. Oh. Oh! Whoa! What a dodge! MLG Mario! It's an MLG Mario! <laughs> let's jump over these and let's see if this works. Oh, do I need one more? He doesn't look too, too happy there. Oh! I've been replacing my twos with shoes lately. Because my name is what? My name is Choo Choo, and that's why dick -a -dick, I was saying Choo instead of two. So one more. Let's just do this one more time, okay? One more time. Hopefully, we can take out this fella. Oh no! Oh no! Where's all the wieners gone? Where's my wiener gone? Where's my wiener gone? There's no wieners left. Hopefully, we need the wieners to respawn. Let's see. Wiener, respawn. If this doesn't work. Oh no, alright, that's it. I'm gonna just have to sneak past Bowser. Then the owls lay down. Let's go. Okay, hopefully he jumps in the air or something. He's like, let's dance, baby. If he does a big jump in the air, I'm gonna. I'm gonna okay, so that's how I'm gonna get past him when he does that big jump in the air. Oh, I could have got past him there. I don't think I'm able to get past him if he does that. Yeah, jump again there, mate. Go on, jump one more time. Go on, go on, jump. <laughs> I tried, I tried. That would have been so funny. Oh, you know what? That was pretty close. Oh, I have an idea. I get the shell. I do that jump and I throw the shell at it. Oh, what if that was it? Holy guacamole. I can make that jump. Look at that. Oh, yeah. I'm definitely getting bar better. Better at maybe Mario. Oh, come on, baby. I'm starting to feel confident now. I've got that double jump. Because if I even miss stuff. Come on, come on. Yes. He didn't wake you up. Cheese, mate. So here we go. We've got the rhythm. Feel the rhythm. Feel the rhyme. Get up, get up. It's Mario time. Oh, okay. I've got it this time. Come on, lads. We can do it. We're going to complete this level. It's taken forever. But you know what? I'll build his level real fast. So that won't take too long. But you guys are going to like what I'm going to build him. So what have I just done? What have I just done? I just gave him a kiss. I went up and said, give me a kiss there, Mario Laddie. Give me a little kiss, Aruni. I just want me wieners, but you won't give me a kiss. And then he took me out, so it was kind of sad times. But anyway, oh, we've got it. Come on, I'm feeling motivated now. You stop. You stop stamping on my wieners, okay? No, wiener. Come back, wiener. Oh, God, wiener, wiener, wiener. No, no, no. <laughs> this is going to be top comment. I know it. All right, let's get this guy. Let's go I'll drop down here. And uh, let's go jump over here. Do 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 choo 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 Oh I think I need more speed. I think I got need the speed. Let's go baby. Right, we're gonna do this. This is definitely how you do it. I'm nearly a hundred percent sure that this is how we're gonna complete this level. It's good stuff. Whoa! Okay, skipping jumps like a boss just because I can and I've ran out of wieners. No! I needed more wieners. Where's the wieners gone? I even ran back to the start. <gasps> Wait a minute. There we go. There's a secret area here. <laughs> oh, man. Right. Stampy Long Nose, you trickster. You tricky little cat. I told you guys there was something sneaky up here. I told you. All right, let's see what he's hidden up here. 
Oh, wow, I can't believe this, you sneaky little kitty cat. Now, hold on a minute. I bet you he has something back here. This is what Stampy do. He'd hide something even back here. Just as a little Easter egg. So let's head back here and see what we can do. Come on, baby. I'm going to get back here. This level is actually really cool. I'll feel real proud if I've completed it, if we do complete it. And oh. Okay, maybe he didn't have something sneaky. There was a few coins there, but ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. So I knew there was something sneaky up here. Let's go find out what's down the bottom part here. Okay, let's be very careful. And there it is! Oh, man, we got past that part finally. Oh, Bowser, no! No, Bowser! No, no! Don't even think about it, buddy. Oh, God. Oh, no! Oh, oh, oh! He just got wrecked by the map! Unreal! We did it! We completed it! We Bowser boozled Bowser and Bowser boozled that's that's what we did. We just completed it. And thanks Stampy Longhouse for making me this map because I actually really enjoyed getting annoyed at how bad I was at completing it. But anyway guys, I think we did it. We had to sacrifice a few little wieners on the way, but we'll see them in a future episode, I'm sure. If you guys enjoyed <laughs> that, stay tuned because I'm gonna flip over and start making him a map. Let's go! Let's go make a back to the the future map. Woohoo! Well guys, we just completed Stampy's map. Now it's time to go back from the future instead of back to the future. Which doesn't make sense. Is it the future to the back to the front or the back to the front to the future? What if the future's in the past? Is that the present or is that the behind the present of the past? What if we went from the present to the past and then back to the future? Does that mean we're in the future or the past? If you can answer that, let me know in the comment section below. Anyway, uh, <laughs> hopefully I didn't confuse too many people, but I was trying really hard to. Um, what I'm going to do here is, I'm going to make a map for my good friend, and I think what we'll do is, we'll be in kind of the past, and we're going to drive the car to the future. I think that's a good idea. So the first things first, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to build like a castle to match the castle at the end of the level, because that's going to show the past, and then we're going to go to the future. Maybe I can, you know, um, shake this around. I don't know how to, how do I change the flag or something? Is there any way I can change the f this ending? I'm not sure if I can actually change the ending, guys, but we just say we're going back to the past again, okay? So we have to make a castle all the way back here to show that we're in the past. So let's make a castle, right? We're going to make a nice little castle. We're going to have the little thingies on the top of the castle and everything, okay? So let's do a nice little castle. As you can see, I have the castle done already because I'm that much of a saucy little bossy. And uh, there we go, we have our door and everything. So that's our castle. Maybe we can do a nice little cannon or two on the top of the castle to show that the castle is awesome. So, or, yeah, that's pretty cool actually. We have our awesome castle here as well. So that's sweet. We have our little castle. Maybe we can put a little king in the castle just to show an enemy that you have to get past so let's try put a ghost in the castle because we actually just came out of a map where we were fighting bears in the castle so that kind of makes a bit of sense as well so that's that shows the past there's a castle you get it we're in the past maybe we can put something in the background to make it feel more like the past maybe it's in like a jungle a castle a jungle castle that makes sense what about that a jungle castle there we go so we're in some sort of a jungle castle so we're in the past, now all we got to do is drive to the future. So how we're going to do that is we're going to make a lovely car like the one from the Back to the Future. And I'm actually going to just move this up out of my way for a minute. And then we'll drag that down behind it in a sec after we make the car. What I'm going to use is these icy blocks. And we're going to make a car. We're going to have a little spoiler there. We're going to have the big roof up here. We're going to have a come down. Then we're going to have our little engine and everything. So there's our car, we're going to have, where we have the front wheel, we'll have the front wheel there, and we'll have the back wheel there, and then we'll just fill up all this, and maybe we'll even put a little driver in the car, what do you guys think, how about we go and get, let's say we get some bomber men here, we can have them as wheels, <laughs> and then the driver of the car, we'll have this little fella here, he can be the driver of the car, because he'll pop up and down at different points, and he'll just be there, let's test that out and see what he looks like. So yeah, look, he's in the car, he should pop up any sec. Oh, I don't know how I got stuck in that there. Let's see if we can see the little driver the car. Hello, yeah, look, he's driving the car. <laughs> he's waving out the window at us. This is hilarious. Okay, that's great. Now what I'm going to do is put the booster on the car to show the car 
driving like it's ready to go to the future right hold on a sec let's just drag this back here and even if i can put another one here to show extra speed there that'll be good does that like does that make it really epic okay i'm after doing way too many of them there lol okay there we go we've got loads of boosters going back to the future and then what i was thinking of doing is because the car is just changing we'll have the terrain starting to gradually change so i'll just do that there and then i'll have a fully changed here right or actually what i'm gonna do is not gonna have any ground there and that way it'll just look like we're kind of in time time and space so that'll be pretty sweet and then we can uh, have the have wherever we're traveling to which could be modern day at the end so that's pretty cool and then we'll have a castle behind that which just you know ruins the whole point but who cares let's just forget there's a castle at the end of that <laughs> so let me just kind of start meshing this in with the other stuff to show that just breaking away and what i'm gonna do is guys for time and space i'm just gonna have lots of these little dots up here and maybe we'll add a little background i'm not gonna have too many because i don't want to make it too hard and then we can add maybe a different background here as well so let's see what backgrounds we have oh that's perfect now let me drag this down here before i forget so we have that down there the car is starting to go into the future and we have all this stuff oh no i'm after dragging it off screen let me just put it up here and let's see if i can drag this all the way down here Am I able to yeah there we go right so we'll put start it about there because it's only starting to go into the future so we have it all there as well so that's it going through time and space then i can start kind of trickling it with more of these guys so let's do less and less and then we're gonna have the end here now what i'm gonna do is have a bunch of these platforms that stampy's gonna have to try use to get by so let's do this whoa let's get some of these guys here and see if stampy can figure out a smart way to get by without hitting any of those damaging little fragments in time and space so yeah very interesting map idea i'm actually glad i know this i was like how am i gonna do back to the future <laughs> i was a bit worried about it so let's do it like that that one looks really tough and then we'll have one going up here as well and then all i gotta do is move this back and build where we've been traveling to so i was thinking maybe we could do like a skyscraper uh like a building and that could be the finish line so how about we make some uh, well, I don't want to build out the same stuff we built the castle out of. How about we build it with... What would be good? We build it with these coins because they're nice and shiny. And skyscrapers are, like, shiny. So let's make the floor up like this. All right, let's fill the floor all the way back here. Why not? And then we'll be able to build a big skyscraper on top. And it'll be absolutely amazing, right? So I've got my big platform ready for the skyscraper and then what i'm going to do is just put a bunch of these coins everywhere and what we'll do is make stampy climb up the big skyscrapers and that's how he's going to get past here he's going to have to do some parkour and get past the big old skyscrapers so there we go should i just leave little gaps for the windows or will i just put loads of different ones in for the windows i think that's what i'll do i'll just put loads and loads and loads of different ones in for the windows so that kind of looks like a skyscraper. If you guys want to try build your own version of a Back to the Future map, I'd love to see it. Maybe you can put some in the comment section below and I will check them out. So I'll just cover it, fill this in. And have uh, maybe I'll get rid of the top lines up here to make it a bit better and make it a bit pointy because at the top of skyscrapers it actually is a bit pointy. So let me do that. There we go that looks sweet right so we've got one skyscraper let's try and make a, another one but let's leave a hole down the bottom because he's gonna have to figure out he's gonna have to go down the bottom to get to that hole and then he's gonna have to actually climb back up to get out so that's how he's gonna get through there he's gonna park or through there like a little salty ballsy so this is gonna be sweet and then i'm just gonna put some um stuff here like that i'm gonna put some little a uh, what do you call them little shiny box around me so i think this is really cool guys that's how he's gonna get past there how am i gonna block him up here i think i'm gonna have to put a barrier up here to stop him from getting past the final bit so what could we do up at the, up at the top there to stop him getting past maybe we could put we'll just put an old school pipe here 
How about that? We'll have we'll have pipes coming out of the ceiling because that totally makes sense. <laughs> we'll just block the world with pipes. Right, so there we go. Let's just put this here. Got a pipe for days. And there we go. Right, so that was actually really really handy to make i enjoyed making that map and i think it's time to test it if you guys think this map is good if it looks too hard let me know so let's just add in maybe one or two little coins here and see if we can make it easier for them to get through so let's give them that and bada bing bada boom maybe add one or two baddies into the mix some people in the city and then we've got it. I think we are ready to go. Hmm, interesting stuff. So yeah, I'm ready. I am ready to take on the city. Now, how are we going to get up this part, actually? I, I never thought of that. I just presumed he'd be able to parkour across the whole map. Maybe I can have some... Let's see. Maybe I can put a thingy here. Right, we'll put that there. And let's see what happens when I stand on this, actually. So nothing happens. Great. So what I was thinking is we could have some coins here that will turn into blocks and that's what we can use to parkour up to this city Ooh. so hopefully Stampy will be able to figure that out I'm sure he will he's a smart kitty cat and there we go so that's how we're gonna parkour up there and um, gonna have to make sure that he doesn't break any of those coins we're gonna have to put extra ones down here so there we go got got extra coins in case he messes it up and falls down so there we go, bada bing, bada boom, boom boom, shake the room. So we're gonna actually go and test this out now. Let's go, let's try test out the map I made for Stambi. Let's go back to the future, woohoo! Right, so I'm gonna just go to um, new save. I'm gonna save it in my files. If anybody wants to try and play it, you guys can, it's pretty fun. And uh, let's save it over this one called Unreal Save. Yes, let's override it. And let's say um, Stampy goes back to the future. Ooh, very nice. Okay, Stamp goes back to the future. Whoa, yeah, well, it doesn't really look right, but YOLO. <laughs> Let's just do it. Okay, I'm ready, guys. Let's do the test round. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We have to do it. We have to do it. Are you guys ready? Let's go. Come on, baby. Let's complete this map. Hopefully, we can do it pretty fast because it's been a pretty long episode, but I'm sure you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. We get, well, let's, let's sorry, take out a few people and not get wrecked by some wieners. Attempt to clear course now. Yes, please. Okay, I'm going to try. I'm going to do it first time. I don't expect to do it first time. But I'm actually going to try just this once. Because I said earlier on in the video that I never expect to do it. So what I'm going to have to do is bounce off this wall. And uh, get onto one of those little balls. And try jump up. So let's see if that's possible. Oh no. Oh no. I don't think that's actually possible. Oh mate. What an epic fail. <laughs> is it possible? Let's try it. Come on. Alright. Let's see if I can just go here. Whee Come on, come on, come on. Okay, we're gonna have to fix this. I actually just focused on building the map instead of making it <laughs> so you can get past that part. Let's see, what could I put there to get past it? Hmm. Let's try putting Yoshi. No, we can't put a Yoshi down. Yoshi is too OP. Let's just put, let's put one of these guys here, right? We're gonna have, we're gonna surround the castle. By some of this stuff, it's kind of a gate. That's a good idea. It looks like a castle gate, doesn't it, guys? So that's why we have that there, little castle gate. To keep the castle nice and safe from the evil Stamparoonies. And while we're at it, actually, let me just add something really cool. I kind of think that these would look sweet on the top of the castle. That's, that's, I'm just doing that. I know it's making it a bit harder, but just, just, just go with it, okay? Now let's, let's do it. <laughs> Save and upload. We got, we didn't get past the very start of the map. It says a lot about my map making skills. Completely forget to make it that you can get past the start. And it's kind of good that they make you test the map yourself so you can get past it. So here we go. Oh, I, I done great there. Let's try do this thing. Do, 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 do. Do. I'm up past the very start 
I just dropped that out here. Do -do -do -do. Let's get my mushroom. Let's go through the atmosphere. Okay, so I'm gonna have to do a run and jump there to get past this one. There's like a little gap here. Come on, baby. Hey! Oh, nice! Hey! Oh, <laughs> this is actually going great. Okay, okay, I didn't do too good that time. Oh, okay, we made it past that part. I'm actually doing pretty good here, guys. Okay, I'm gonna have to parkour up here. Bada bing, bada boom, boom, boom. Shake the room, and let's go! Come on, I won't pass the skyscraper. I'm gonna have to drop down here. All right, hopefully this guy doesn't take me out. Excuse me, sir. Boing. Let's just go past here, and hopefully I can just get up here. Oh, this is actually pretty tough. So we did go back to the future, and let's just drop down here, and we completed it. So there you go, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed that. For Stampy doing it, I might stick Bowser in the city just to make it that bit harder. But uh, hopefully you guys do enjoy the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Choo-choo, wibbity-woo, out. Bye!